Hey guys, today I'm gonna to be reading the book that my father wrote. Three, two, one, start. I love to wear my favorite pair of socks. He calls them left sock and right sock. One day in the laundry room, the socks asked me, hey, what are those single socks doing hanging over there? I said, that is a very special place for socks. It is called the sock spot. That is where socks go when their mate is lost. In the sock spot, a single sock is never alone and always has other sock friends to play with. If you ever get separated, always meet back at the sock spot. Let me see. Let's see this. Sometimes me and my sister were getting ready for the bath. Oh. My mom told them, Put your socks in a dirty clothes basket. But I didn't listen. Well, me and my sister were playing in the tub. Me and me, me grabbed my left sock and ran off while no one was looking. Let me see. Um, um, okay. Very loud. The loudest of all. <laughs> Just kidding. After, after my bath, Mom noticed left sock was missing and asked Roman, where's left sock? Where is left sock? I can't seem to find it. Me and my sister looked, looked all throughout the house. Left sock was lost. Show me, show me. Show me every single page. Use 11 microphones, right? Keep going, keep. Hurry. Use 11 microphones. At bedtime, Roman's mom asked him, Do you know what to do with right sock? He replied, Yes, mom. When right sock is clean and dry, I'll take right sock to the sock spot. The next day in the laundry room, I told right sock, You have to stay here with the other single socks until we find left sock. The right sock answered, Please find my best, best friend. Okay. Uh, the other socks in the sock spot were friendly to right sock and told him you are never alone in the sock spot it is a safe place you can hang here and play with us until your mate is found show me every single page mm -hmm. scream it yeah, yeah scream it <laughs> stop scream it keep going. Keep going. i was i left the laundry room and went to the I left the laundry. I left the laundry room and went to the backyard to look for lost left sock. Show me. Next page. I'll show you. Like this. Show me. Show me the bat. No. Yes. Yeah. Scream it. Yeah. I then spotted a fly Louder. sitting in a tiny cup at a tiny table, sipping in a teeny tiny cup of coffee. I asked, excuse me, Mr. Fly, have you seen my lost left sock? The fly warned me, I have not seen your sock because I'm not from here, so leave me alone or I will flick your ear. Well, well, Mr. Fly, if you spot a single sock, stick it in the sock spot. Little boy, I have not seen your silly sock because I just flew here from France and that, I'm afraid, was your very last chance. The French fly then flew right up to me and curled his little fly finger back and flicked my ear and said, Sky blue. No, shoo, shoo boy, shoo. No, I'm sorry. I left that nasty fly in the corner of the backyard and he came across a soggy mud patch. There were two eyes sticking out of the mud and I had to ask, who are you all covered in mud? I am a crawfish, he said. How are you, my friend? I replied, not good. Nobody can help me. I lost my left sock. I met a lizard who was lazy. I got blown by, blown a kiss by a bat and flicked by a French fly. So, Mr. Crawfish, please, if you spot my single sock, stick it in the sock spot. Do the British accent. Mr. Crawfish replied, I keep my eyes sticking out the mud all day long. So I see everything that 
can possibly go on. Why just last night, about seven o'clock, I see that meanie weenie dog with the poor little sock. I ran as fast as he could to meanie weenie dog's house. I ran straight back to the sock spot and finally left sock and right sock are back together again. All were happy and agreed that the sock spot is the best place for lonely socks. Let me see. So. Bye. 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 See you later.